tragic incident late Friday evening. A passenger train collided with a stationary goods train in Tamil Nadu. That resulted in the derailment of at least 12 coaches and leaving several passengers injured. The collision occurred at around 8.30 a.m. at a railway station in Thiruvallur district near Chennai. And restoration work is currently underway in full swing after parcel van of the express train caught fire and 19 passengers uh, reportedly got injured. Take a look at this report sent by my colleague Varshini from the incident site. It's been over uh, 13 to 15 hours after the accident uh, took place and there is an extensive um, repair work that is ongoing right now. Uh, we are at the accident site and right now we can see here that the Southern Railway officials uh, and the workers here are uh, immediately uh, trying to remove these uh, boogies from uh, the tracks because uh, yesterday all night they were working on repairing the damaged uh, railway tracks on the other side and now now uh, they are, uh, you know, they have to remove these boogies. Only then they can continue with the repair work of the railway lines. And uh, as you can see, there are so many workers uh, deployed here. We are uh, able to get uh, clear pictures of how they are using uh, JCB, in, uh, uh, JCB vehicles uh, to try and lift uh, uh, the parcel van. This is the main important uh, compartment of uh, the train, the express train, which was completely damaged, which was caught on fire, which was ablaze, and where uh, fire and rescue officials had to come to put it out. And right now you can see that they are working on on uh, removing this bougie from the uh, line, lanes and also only after them uh, being able to remove all these bougies uh, they will be able to uh, repair uh, the lines and what is also important to note is that uh, the technical teams, the technical officials from uh, the Southern Railways, from the Bengaluru Division, had reached here today morning and they had uh, conducted an inspection. They had checked uh, an, an intense inquiry on what have happened here. And on the other hand, we are able to see new engine uh, that has also been brought and kept ready so that uh, once all these bougies are taken out from the debris, they will be able to connect it to the engine and they can be able to uh, remove move all these uh, compartments from the location so that they can continue on with the repair work to resume operations as soon as possible. It is uh, clearly all decks on hand. Uh, everybody uh, is uh, here. Uh, they are uh, coming uh, together to ensure that there is a speedy recovery from this unfortunate incident. And now we are seeing reactions coming in from political parties as well. Uh, after this incident took place, DMK, Congress as well as UBT Sena have hit out at the railway minister of the country on what has happened uh, uh, in this particular case. Uh, in fact, Rahul Gandhi has said no lessons have been learned and accountability starts at the top. UBT Sena has also uh, taken a jibe at the railway's minister, Mr. Ashwini Vaishnav. And Tamil Nadu's uh, Deputy Chief Minister Udenidhi Stalin has said that government must stop train accidents. Let's go across to uh, my colleague uh, Varshini. But uh, before that, let's listen in to this reaction coming in from Udenidhi Stalin. <laughs> அனுமதிக்கப்பட்டிருக்கிறாங்க <laughs> Let's 
Let's now go across to my colleague Ankit who is joining us live for more on this with some more reactions I believe that have come on this particular story. Ankit, over to you. So Hina, let's read Rahul Gandhi's first. Now he says and his takeaway is that the Mysuru Darbhanga train incident mirrors the horrific Balasor accident, a passenger train colliding with a stationary goods train. Despite many lives lost in numerous accidents, no lessons are learnt. Accountability starts at the top. How many more families must be destroyed before this government wakes up? His sister, Priyanka. Priyanka Gandhi Vadra, the translation of what she has written reads, train accidents have become so common in the country that despite train accidents happening one after the other, neither any accountability is being fixed by the government nor any action is being taken. Crores of common people of the country are forced to travel with their lives at risk in trains running on the wheels of fear and chaos because the government has turned its back on the responsibility of ensuring safe train travel. Once again, an accident like Balasore, Orissa happened with the Mysore Darbhanga Express in Tamil Nadu. So she is mirroring uh, what Rahul Gandhi said. And then Priyanka Chaturvedi writes, who has the real mantri blamed for this derailment? That is a term she uses for the real minister Priyanka Chaturvedi of the UBT Sena. Hina. All right, Ankit, thank you for the moment for joining us with all of those reactions that we have got. We'll see how the Union Railway Minister will respond to these. Uh, with this